Hey everybody, it's Michael from Barry Hiking, guys. Give me that information, give me that knowledge, hike with confidence. Welcome to the channel if you're new. Welcome, welcome, welcome. We've got uh, all kinds of stuff in the Bay Area as far as tips, tricks, stuff that we use, hikes to check out, and as well as plants. And one of those big topics that we're going to talk about today is a particular plant. And it's a plant that a lot of people uh, kind of flip out about, or they always have questions about, is it, uh, it going to get you in the winter? What does it look like in the winter when all the leaves fall off? Uh, all that good stuff, so we're going to talk about that in the video. Stay tuned. All right, so let's talk about poison oak. Those three leaves stay away kind of deal. They've got the three leaves on them, and it's got that glossy look to them. But in the winter, they're kind of really hard to tell because the leaves haven't fully come out yet, so you're not going to see the three leaves. But... Um, I'm up here and I've actually got poison oak right next to me. Now poison oak is effective in the winter. You can get it, you can start itching away and uh, start transferring that, you know, when you itch, you itch one part of your body, oils will get in under, underneath your fingernails and then you'll start itching another part of your body and boom, you've got poison oak rash all over the place and not good. So um, if you're really sensitive to poison oak in general, I recommend you do all precautions to stay away from it. Wear long sleeves, wear long pants to keep yourself away from, from getting poison oak and kind of not notice what it looks like in that particular year that you're hiking. And we're going to help you out for the winter. Poison oak is, is when it pops up, it's got this kind of a red looking color and you'll see it and it'll start popping up and then you'll see the stem going all the way through and then you'll see um, little secondary stems that are coming up with that red color for the leaves. And it's kind of hard to notice it's definitely open and bold and it's always important if you don't if it's harder for you to understand what it looks like is to go and find it when it's easier to identify during the summer and you might see it and go okay well that's poison oak i can see it come back in the winter and take a look at it and say hey okay well that's what it looks like in the winter if you need that actual physical visual look of it it's a good way to kind of get your get your information down on what it looks like during the different seasons but we're definitely going to help you it is something to take precautions of and like i said if you're really sensitive skin wise keep all away from it all right guys well uh, stay tuned for more videos we're trying to pop out about one or two videos a week all the new subscribers as well as the current subscribers welcome we appreciate all the comments the feedback all that good stuff. Thank you so much. You're very encouraging to us, uh, me and Beth. We really do appreciate it. So thank you guys. Have a good one.